Hi, this is Lil Dwarf playing games while rambling incoherently into a microphone. Why? Well, just because I can. And they continue with Legacy of Cain, Soul Reaver 2, Blind. Now, I'm trekking back to the stronghold of the Seraphon uh, because Cain, I mean, Raziel, allowed, alluded to the fact that with the Dark Soul Reaver, I might be op able to open. The, the, a gate there. Mm, it shouldn't be far now. Although, wait, I might have lied, because there's still the pillars in the way. But to be honest, mm, um, I, I wasn't expecting another conversation with the Elder God, so it might actually be good to swing by the pillars uh, and see if maybe the ghost of Ariel has arrived there, or you know, something else maybe is going to happen. Um... Hmm. I'm not sure what's up with those waypoints. I did mark them all uh, on the way here. So... Should I go back and try to use it? But, but I think I still have the dark, although, hmm, not sure. To be honest, better safe than sorry, I will go back slightly. Uh, okay, so I didn't have the dark soul reaver, it looks distinctly different. Because Raziel has stated I'm going to need it mm, to enter that place I am trying to enter. Okay, that might have been a mistake, because I'm not sure if I transport back to the material world, will I reti retain the Dark Soul Reaver? The answer is no, which is a huge bummer, generally speaking. Mm, so that is a pure result of my of my own stupidity.
I think I need to go back. Actually. Unless it carries over saves, maybe? It does. Mm, although I still have little idea of how to actually make the door open. Like it's clear to me it has something to do with this glowing crystal. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. I, I didn't come from here. Was this always open? Okay, I, I'm rather confused. Oh, okay. I did come from here, I guess. I do remember this uh, specifically. I'm not sure what this is. Ah, this is like a, like a crank for operating the door, I guess. The underwater door through which I just swam. Because I, I jumped from this terrace originally. I thought I didn't remember it. I thought I jumped from the other one on the other side. But I specifically was here. And there is uh, a door with the image of the circle within a circle. Which seems to imply uh, it's definitely where I need to go now. And open it with the Dark Reaver.
These murals left no room for doubt. These winged creatures were indeed the architects of the pillars. And while the images were difficult to decipher, the pillars appeared to banish or diminish their enemies somehow. Mm, with the Dark River, press action to activate. Okay, first of all, the, the architecture here, the change in architecture is rather, rather mm, noticeable. Like, all of this looks sort of vaguely Egyptian, which I didn't get that vibe from the previous temple. I wonder if that means anything. Okay, I'm somehow, somehow repelled. Mm, I should be able to go through this, to be honest. If I change to a uh, spectral form. Oh, that's a new type of enemy in the Shadow Realm.
Hmm. He spawned and was killed instantly. Which <laughs> which I guess which I guess was was a warning for me. <laughs> Okay, I'm, I'm a total sucker. Mm. I freely admit that. Mm. So what do I do about this? Sentry Eye with the Dark Reaver projectile. Is there an option to disable those hints? There is. I will do it, even though I feel like I kind of need them, but I feel very coddled by them. And they feel like they are very condescending. So, so, so to be honest, how, however painful it might be to be... Uh, to be stuck from time to time, I, I find that less painful than to constantly be treated by the game as if I am mentally deficient. Uh, I'm not saying I, I'm not, I'm just saying, uh, you know, feeling like that is, is not a great feeling. So I'll turn them off and hopefully I'll get through it somehow. Mm, but I lost the Dark Reaver, right? Yeah, this is just a regular river, as it were. So I have to go all the way back. It's a bit annoying, but I guess it's totally my own fault mm, for, for falling for the you know, you know dumbest traps trap in the history of forever. Uh, because basically the game directly has directly shown me that I'm going to, to be killed if I stepped forward, and I did anyway. Okay, I think this is the correct position. Once I get the light disc to place over here... Mm. I guess first I need to find the freaking... Uh, uh, Dark River Shrine again. I can't even cross this. Mm, I don't have the right reaver.
Hmm. Okay, I'm not entirely sure how to once again turn corporeal. Or if I can't, I guess I have to find a Riva shrine on the other side and then open the side doors. I have to be missing something because obviously the game wouldn't force me to be stuck uh, without being able to open the previous doors and without being able to change the river so I have to be overlooking something
Maybe I can move this. But it's it's lucky the disc. Hmm. Will it open the door if I And he had the glowing disc, so now I can just grab this and go back. without to be honest I don't think I can even drop it so I guess it's in intended for the for the other side right here the right so river so I guess I can temporarily rotate this to open the door I'm not particularly enamored with combat in Soul Reaver, so and that's why and that's why I'm not stopping. Uh, still, still not the still not the right Reaver though. I guess maybe I could face through this. Okay, there's finally a shrine for the Dark Reaver, uh, so I can, if I, if, if I find a way to become corporeal again, I can mm, 
open all those passages from before. Okay, so I need to go back to transform it and then try not to die. Literally a Tamas because this can be opened with the Dark Reaver, so I don't need to. Mm, I don't need to turn Spectral. Mm, and then there are a couple of doors on this side. The number of enemies is a little bit ridiculous, so to be honest, I don't care much about that. to transfer the light um, onto the other thing the jig So that's one of them. Clearly missing something. We 
which is actually one of those glowing discs that they should connect. This is lacking a disc, and and I can't dislodge this, uh, even if I could in the game's mechanic, which I'm not even sure of that. But I can't dislodge it because I need it. I need this this side this side to be. Uh, oh, right, 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 right. There's the whole thing about blinding the eye with the dark reaver. I totally forgot about that. So maybe that's where. Uh, another of those glowing discs is supposed to be. Oh, come on! I have to get back uh, and get the Dark Reaver again, which is rather annoying and yet again entirely my fault, so there's no, no one to blame but me and my own stupidity and clumsiness. action button around here because it's clear this is something I should probably pick up Yeah, I'm clicking the action button and nothing is happening. I'm pretty sure that the central thing, uh, this over here, is something I'm supposed to pick up. Mm. So I'm definitely confused. I was doing this! Okay, I'm very annoyed. it though and how because I can't jump the gap over here because I, I can't glide with it in hand hmm. <laughs> yeah, obviously I can't turn 
incorporeal either uh, because <laughs> will something happen if I try to add it to this? It's pretty clear to me I'm supposed to install it on the other side, but what, what, what is not clear to me is how to do that. this as I said I don't think I can drop it uh, so wh wh wherever it is I need to stick it should be reachable so otherwise how am I I can't glide with it and I can't drop it seemingly so Okay, but I'll try figuring it out next time because I feel like this episode has already been too long, uh, in fact. So I will uh, pause it here and end it for now. That's all for this one and I will see you in the next one. Bye!